Yo, what up, YouTube? Real quick, anyways, man, it's your boy Zab. But basically, what I'm gonna get into today, uh, as you can see, th this is right after the video that I just put out. But it's like it's like a thing going on the internet now with this dude, uh, Wag Wag 100. And I'm just gonna get down to the the meat and potatoes. At the end of the day, dude says something along the line like he don't fuck with outsiders as far as like he won't sign them and he won't really have nothing to do with them. And I can understand from a certain uh, perspective because at the end of the day. Dude that did a lot of time Probably war with the homies multiple times And at the end of the day A lot of them just don't want to see us shine anyway It's just what it is And a lot of people I'm, I'm, I'm a little taken back That they're really tripping off this dude Or, or want to associate themselves with him uh, Period Like don't get me wrong I don't know this dude shit from Sherlock I got rallies that's from his hood You know what I mean uh, Some might even be his G But at the end of the day Dude, dude is one of those cats that you know he he says what he says he's controversial and and he's out there i mean as far as like being you know and it's just one of those things why i couldn't understand why castle want to really get in bed with him anyway not to no homo but why they really want to get in bed with this dude anyway especially after he just did the thing with six nine understand this dog like there's fools that's on my on my page like i get it you know that that may be your homeboy but at the end of the day if 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 your homeboy interview a PC, that speaks bad of him, especially being incarcerated. But like I said, that's not, that's nor here nor there because it's not necessarily our, you know, it's not on us to, to try to go out and check this dude. That's between him and the Bloods and the Pyrus and whatever he, he claims now. But my whole thing is like when I see homies upset at the fact that he don't, because he said he don't fuck with the double S like that. It, it's... I mean, it goes without saying, you know, do probably know people that, that, that lost their life because homies then took it. So it's just one of those things. It's, it's, it's cool as motherfuckers want to be with certain cats. At the end of the day, a lot of them don't give a fuck about you because you're double S, dog. Double S is known to be grimy, have did a lot of grimy shit and still do a grimy shit. And we still hold ourselves on a certain level, like... You're dealing with cat. Any cat that would, would write see any cat that's a, supposed to be solid and sit down with a PC to do an interview is a cat that you shouldn't want to deal with. Period. Like I said, I don't know this dude, so I don't really have nothing against him because at the end of the day, it doesn't hurt me. He's not my homeboy. You know what I mean? I'm not trying to talk to this dude. Not, I see him on the street, walk right by him. He, he's not from my hood, and he ain't a south sider. So why would I even worry about him? The whole reason I'm speaking on him and not even speaking on him but speaking on this whole subject of, of people want to make it a race thing it, it's okay that's that's why you get your that's why you do your shit you get on and you push dudes like that to, because at the end of the day dudes only have to dudes only have a shine for so long they got to constantly look for controversy in order to be relevant we've seen it many times before you just got to get past it, dog. A lot of these cats that are, are in the industry right now that got the, the that got the capability to put you on, they're not putting you on because they, they follow the same rhetoric as some of these dudes in the industry. They don't want you to take the shine like, okay, well, I'm, I'm, I'm Raza Americano. I got in, you know, by the, by the grace of God because I had to change my whole stilo to something else. I don't want to see you get on. So, I, you know, I, you know, these be the same cats that be with these dudes talking shit about you probably plotting your demise like you you got to really sit back and, and and really see what it is it the, the industry is 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 racist and there's a lot of cats that like i said the double s has known for being grimy and it's not even being grimy just when it's time to get off we get off you know what i mean and like i said in in, in a video in the past we never won every war but we won a lot of them you know what i'm saying we won a lot of them it, it, it just plain and simple is just what it is whether it's the numbers or whatever it don't matter war is war and, and when it comes down to it it's about who wins the war if you don't win the war you lost w's and l's but there's a lot of cats right now excuse me that are upset at that fact and they don't want to see you win and they ain't gonna never want to see you win dude straight out said he ain't gonna sign no homie it's just what it is you 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 know, but you still got a lot of homies that be riding this dude's wave, like, not even his wave, but just be on his jock, like, it is what it is, man. At the end of the day, you got to do them the same way they do you. And I, it, I said in the prior video, you fuck with the ones that want to fuck with you. When it came to YG, YG only did certain things for the, you know, but you had Slim 400 that was fucking with the homies, like, like it was just a thing to do because he see where it was at. The, the cats know, dog, like, 
at the end of the day that's why you have foods to rip the whole stilo they want to use spanish and everything it, it it's 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 a market for that dog it's a, it's people really respond that's why I'm gonna just say this: people, people like to come on and say all the time, "Well, okay, Mexicanos are, are racist," and there's some that are. It's just what it is. In every race, you have races. But to be honest, there's a lot of them. When you embrace their culture, you start learning Spanish, you start doing this. They fuck with you, like they really uh, deal with you because they really respect the fact that you went out your way to learn the culture. Just like there's blacks that when they see. When they see another race, like, really embrace their culture, it's there. Black people have pretty much always been like that. Always happy that another person is embracing their culture. And, of course, you got one that's a lot more militant, so they see it as something different. And they, you know, constantly want to complain about it. But for the most part, people people truly enjoy people when they embrace their, you know, their, their, their whole get down. You know what I'm saying? I know I just went around in circles, but basically I just wanted to put that video out there because it people are acting like it's a secret or something. It's no secret why he don't want to deal with with the homies. It's just what it is. That's why you got to make your own way. I just did a show in IE, and you know what I mean. It's like you had homies, you had blacks, you had everybody. Like I used to become in a different spot. LA is just one of those. Like it's like you got fools that want to fuck with the homies, and you just got a lot that don't. And you got homies that make it look bad because they, they change their whole stilo. They Half of these fools don't even want to say that they're Mexicano no more. They'll claim something way different. And then you find out, like, oh, hold on. Well, you're this. You know what I mean? Like, just to get away from the, the, the that, that so-called stigma of being, you know, a homie. And it's just it's just weird. You know what I mean? And then you got fools that, that say they're homie and I can't tell. Like, I just look at them like, like, fuck, you don't got none of the stilo or nothing. You just... Like something different Like Lots of really Don't want to You know what I mean They don't want to embrace What it is Because they figure It's a dead end job With no chance to get ahead And for the most part When you rap a certain way Yeah You may get far enough Especially You know If you're If you're embraced By by your culture But Now it's like Even when it comes down to uh, You know uh, Latinos and, and, and You know Raza It's like they, They're supporting A whole different culture Anyway It's not they just want to hear good music and it, and it's just the way it is but like i said i went around in circles but the whole thing man i ain't got nothing against whack 100 dude is him he does what he does and it's like for the people that get frustrated at it you're, you're wasting your time dude is not gonna care he doesn't he doesn't find you valuable and and he doesn't find you relevant and you got to do the same thing to him he's not relevant to he's not double s dude this a pyro you know what i'm saying and it's like and his own, a lot of his own homies don't like him, you know what I mean? But that's them. That's not our business, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, man, don't be upset at, at the fact that dude don't want to deal with you. You just, you got to start solidifying the circle and, and start connecting motherfuckers. You can run, you can run the game, dog, with, with the numbers, you know what I mean? Or, or at least you got to do like, you know, and this is not to be on a race here, but you got to be like the Jews and the whites. <laughs> Fuck, fuck putting the artists out Control the Control what What puts the artists out Control The industry Control it, it. It's like this If you It's like Just to be honest It's like if you got the plug Who coming to you So if If, if you owning record companies And this Who you think coming to you The people that want to get on They gonna be black They gonna be this They gonna be that Because you control All the cars in the deck A lot of these cats That like him Don't run shit They're like yeah, they got artists up under them, but they up under somebody, and then whoever's above them is up under. Dude, the the people that own the main companies and shit, they're not even they, none of them black, and and that's why you got other blacks that be trying to tell people the same thing. You need to get on top, but a lot of them don't care. They just they don't give a fuck. They're like, oh, as long as as long as I get on, I don't I don't want to own nothing. That's what you need to do if you want to win. You got to get on top. You got to get on top, create these companies, and then subdivision that on subdivision that and, and start lining it up so people got to come to you. So it's no longer like, oh, I ain't dealing with Hispanics. It's like, oh, if you want to get to a certain point, just like in the 80s, and you know, you wanted to get that work, you had to get at, even to this day, you got to get at certain people. It's just what it is. You got to get back on your grind. If not... You're going to be left behind And you can't cry Just because a motherfucker Don't want to deal I, I see them say something To somebody else That I don't fuck with But It's just being honest He's like 
I don't have to fuck with you. And that's the that's the key thing. Like people fail to realize it's like even even in the industry, we just play the devil's advocate real quick. People don't realize in the industry, people don't have to deal with you. Just because you want to be on a certain label don't mean they have to sign you. That just people had the sheer audacity to, to assume, not even assume, but to feel as if they should be validated and, and their shit is not even there. It's like it it is what it is, dog. Like most homies are not gonna get signed by certain labels because they they still think on that page. And yeah, you can get signed by other labels, but they'll make quick money and keep putting your shit on the shelf unless you get with a company that's that's really about you. And that rarely happens, you know what I mean? But because you're getting blocked by your own people. But I say all this to say this, man. Don't cry over spilled milk, man. Just try harder. Plain a simple fact. Try harder and do better. And that's all you can do, man. Can't fault nobody for not wanting to fuck with you. It is what it is. And it's it, and they only going after what's marketable. If you ain't marketable, not locally marketable you ain't gonna be nothing to them until you're something on that note your boys i'm out